guys, in this video, let's look at the differences between endemic, sporadic, epidemic, pandemic. Okay. So basically, first look at endemic. Endemic is constant presence of a disease or any infection, right? Within a geographical area or population group without importation from outside. So in a particular group, constantly this disease is there. So did you understand what endemic is guys? Endemic is the disease is always there in this group. Okay. Constantly it is there in these people. Okay. Example will be for endemic like malaria, leprosy. These will be endemics. Malaria always there, leprosy always present kind of a thing. Okay. So there will be common source of infection in endemic, right? This can become an epidemic later. In endemic guys, the geographical location involved will be smaller. This will be a smaller group of uh, geographical location will be smaller. Okay. So spatial clustering will be there. Right. There will be spatial clustering. So now let us move on to sporadic. What do you mean by sporadic? Sporadic means irregular half hazard occurrence of cases from time to time. So from time to time it is not constantly present. Sporadically suddenly somewhere it will start coming in. Okay. Irregular half hazard occurrence of cases from time to time. It is infrequent. Okay. This will happen in chicken pox. So what did you see in endemic? Endemic you saw malaria. Sporadic you are seeing chicken pox. Okay. And here there is um, uh, probably or you know little or no connection with each other, no recognizable common source of infection, etc. Okay. Then this also can become an epidemic in severe cases in favorable conditions. This also can become an epidemic. Now, what do you mean by epidemic? Epidemic means unusual occurrence in a community or region. So this is like look at this. This is epidemic so where unusual occurrence okay clearly in excess of the expected occurrences so really high number of cases okay this is a sudden occurrence unusual right and here there are a lot of cases involved the geographical location in an epidemic will be large okay the geographical location in epidemic will be large there will be temporal clustering, spatial clustering, yes. And they exhibit common source of infection, okay. So basically you understood epidemic. Epidemic, the geographical area is more, okay. In endemic, the geographical area is small. Even in sporadic, the geographical area is small. However, in epidemic, it is slightly large. The number of cases are also really number of cases. Okay, large number of cases and in epidemics, the reporting becomes mandatory. Now, what about pandemic? Pandemic is where the entire world, almost entire world is involved. Like in case of AIDS, right? AIDS, they are saying is pandemic. And even diseases like plague, okay, they have the capacity to become pandemics. Now, what is there about pandemic that you should know? So, basically, pandemic means Epidemic affecting the large pop, uh, proportion of population in a wide geographical area. So the epidemic itself affecting large proportion of population in wide geographic area, entire nation, continent or even the world. That becomes a pandemic. Entire nation, like section of nation, entire nation, a continent or the world itself, that becomes a pandemic. Example here, AIDS. Remember, even plague has the capacity to become a pandemic. Okay. They may be common source of infection in this. There is a large geographical location involved. There is temporal clustering in pandemic. Okay. So basically, if you have understood, endemic and sporadic, small areas, epidemic large, pandemic even, even large. Okay. Now, let us look at the cases here. Now, Epi endemic always the disease is present sporadic suddenly it will come suddenly it will go right and epidemic suddenly it has come and lot of people got affected and pandemic has lot of epidemics right so this is what is the difference between endemic sporadic epidemic and pandemic let us look at the examples that we saw endemic we saw malaria sporadic we saw chickenpox Epidemic, we will see things like um, 
polio polio and uh, cholera cholera epidemic pandemic you have seen aids plague etc okay so hope you have understood the differences between these four terms in this video see you in the next video guys bye bye Thank you.